Hello guys, this is TRG, turn up the game. If you don't have super player in your score match, this is the best formation and strategy for you. This is gameplay without any super player. You know our best formation, our preferred formation 4, 2, 1, 3. Played by Madeline. Let's jump into the first game and afterwards, after the first game, we will uh, take a look at the formation, which players are used on which position. But I guess you don't have a maxed out team, right Madeline? No, no, I have a lot of players level 9 and also I want to remind and you that And of level 8. Level, no, so uh, no, 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 it's nine. It's nine. So everyone is level nine and ten mm -hmm. in my team, uh, without any super player. But before talking about my strategy and my matches, I want you to remind that it's very, very impor important to subscribe to our channel yep. and also to like this episode if you wanna uh, see more content about score match mm -hmm. and also if you wanna see the episodes with early access, you can join our membership and uh, get the benefits of it. So now yeah. let's see my long pass to my speedster. I, uh, and it's a, it's a penalty. penalty for me. Bye. Yes. It will be executed by Sokolov, the Menace goal by Sokolov, very, very early goal against Ali from Egypt. Yep. Um, so I guess you're using three strikers, of course, since mm -hmm. it's 4-2-1-3. You have the Speedster as a middle striker? Like no, in the middle? No? no, no, I was trying to You have take, the Menace there. I have the Menace there. I was trying to take the, the baseline from the previous strategy with 4-2-1-3 with super players who have oh. been from the last week. Uh, this is the baseline, I was trying to adapt it, but it was very difficult to decide which one is the CAM and which one is the striker. I was trying several versions of strategies and you will see my strategy after this match. Right. But let's take a look because my opponent was playing uh, very, very well. But, but the hammer, hammer in defense, you have the yes. hammer in defense. By the way, uh, since this is a formation without any super play, this is perfect for beginners. So it is perfect for arenas, uh, I would say up to even arena 8, including. Yes, so I, I was just trying to highlight that my hammers, they are, are amazing. You will see how I'm going to play them. And but Cosmin is right. Side. Yeah. Will it score from here? It's it's a little bit I tough. I was trying to look for a pass, but it's a little bit tough. Miss. Yeah, miss. You, yeah, we all know that the speedster is not the best um, the best goal scorer. Same mm -hmm. as I would say the uh, the, super player, the jet. Ah, the jet. Yeah, exactly. The intruder is score, uh, shoots a little bit better than the speedster. Yeah, and also the intruder uh, used to go a little bit in the middle in mm, order to, yeah. to find the empty space of a the goal. Better angle. Exactly. What formation is your opponent using? Uh, I think 3-5-2. I've, yeah, I've checked in the in the first part of the match. I'm uh, not sure. Let's now. see Speedster now. Uh, the, 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 the response is low. <laughs> but the yeah. same the same for the Jet as well. So you need to keep an eye on his positioning before send the pass. Also, what you have, you must have in mind that again, I'm using the same tips which I uh, give you in the previous episode, especially in the defense. Look at my line. I have four defenders there wow, and I'm the selecting again, only the CDMs. Exactly, right. again, the hammer is there, passing to the other hammer and look at That's this insane. second long pass in the match against Pister is one versus one with the keeper and here and is a not, not a goal, goal but Bad I intruder. have my speedy intruder there. By the way, judging by the, the haircut of of Goosens, by yeah. from the back he looks like the giant. I know, I know, it's very confusing that's, when that's, you see yeah. him there. And now we'll take that's a look on my strategy, on my formation. Uh, this is it. Pause here. Yeah, this is it. So uh, I'm using again Protector okay. in, in my defense. Explorer instead of Voyager, if you remember in the previous version I have the Voyager. Yeah. Hammer and Intruder. Instead of the Invader I have the Intruder. So again, Intruder, mm -hmm. it's very difficult to be played in defense if you want to pass him. But in Don't attack, it's, it's absolutely amazing. But he didn't score for you in this episode yet. Yet. Maybe he was scored. Mm, uh, we will see, we will see. And the Prowler as a CAM. Yeah. Question, why don't you use my Prowler there? Because I have received a lot of comments from our viewers, thank you for your comments, who want me or you okay. also to use their super players, super captains in our team. This is why I prefer to use them there. So I have uh, as a CDM commander and hammer. Mm -hmm. uh, in the previous version, version, I had the major instead of commander. This is why I was trying to keep the same um, version. And here is the surprise: I have the prowler as a CAM okay. and the menace as a striker. And the reason is that uh, the poacher is more stable in attack than the prowler. This is why okay. I prefer the prowler as a CAM because Not he used mobile, to... right? exactly. Mm -hmm. And okay. the prowler is trying to support more the attack. This is why I prefer to keep him there. And the menace is a very, very productive striker. So in theory, you can have up to five strikers in attack. Exactly. Because even the intruder will go and try yeah. to, to help yeah. the attack. And okay. 
uh, one so more remark it's very important to uh, notice that I saved a lot of balls with my explorer and hammer right. I pass them to my hammer at, which is CDM and after that I've sent long passes to my speedster and intruder on the sides because they are very very fast right. and I created a lot of uh, yeah which one do you prefer most the speedster or the intruder in a, uh, on the sides speedster. choose one speedster yeah Mid yeah yeah <laughs> to be honest, even if he used to, to lose a lot of balls there but, but yeah, yeah. but to be honest, the one that I prefer most is the lightning. We yeah, all know yeah, the lightning course, is too. But we are trying to, to stay with the normal, yep. with the regular players. Yep. No uh, golden player, no super no, players, no, no nothing. For this episode, at least. Second game, uh, you are meeting Shaheen. Uh, what formation was he using? 3 5 2. Again, 3 5 2. He was in an amazing winning streak with eight consecutive uh, wins. Okay. I can tell you that this is going to be a very, very difficult match. But I am going to tell you in the end of the match uh, why I decided to keep this match for this episode. Okay. So, but yeah. you should uh, leave focus on, on, on the gameplay now. Mm -hmm. Walk us through what you're thinking when you're passing. Yeah, uh, here I'm trying to send a lot of passes in order to let my opponent come and uh, start the pressing mm -hmm. in order to have some spaces for my okay. speedy wingers. This is a good example. I'm trying to send a long pass. But look at his defender his commander. Orpah, the commander was, yeah. was faster than the intruder, and the intruder seems to seemed to be on on a good lane there. I, I don't yeah. really understand why he didn't run faster. Uh, my expectation is that the response uh, from the commander is more no, right, is more right, is, right. is higher than yeah, the correct. intruders. Correct. Now so look at my opponent who is wow, trying. Again, a, again, a, a very good header by the intruder back yep. there. And yep. I don't know who the striker was for him, but I guess it was. Uh, it was a, a tall guy. Uh, yeah, I think, I think it was the intruder, menace there. The, I think the intruder was in, a, in an offset there, unfortunately. Yeah, this is why I decided to try yeah. to pass to the menace, but unfortunately it was not a success. Was it just a pass. I think by the same commander. Yeah, honest, yeah, I think so also. Now, if another cross, now that's gonna be a go Oh, Kevin! Kevin there! Sorry, Kevin, Kevin the, the, the hammer. hammer. Yeah. So good, the hammer in defense. Maybe the hammer in defense is better than the bulldozer in defense. Yeah, yeah I think so also. But look at this amazing pass. Wow. And my intruder decided to turn around and send the pass. I was very, very confused. I decided to do that, oh. but it was the wrong decision oh, for myself. Come my on, intruder, why did you do that? I think it would have been better to pass it maybe to the menace there in the middle. Uh, yeah, but I think yeah, he, uh, yeah, the, I the think defender right. would have taken the ball away from him because of the response again. That's why the poacher is so OP now, because of the response, shooting and also a yeah. little bit of speed. But in yeah. headers, the menace is, is very good. Yeah. You tried here maybe to give the ball to him and he took yeah, yeah. it out to of To have my, my, my possession there. Mm -hmm. So uh, guys, again, I repeat because it's very important regarding the defending style. Don't select the defenders. Again, yeah. you have a clear four line um, defenders there which are not influenced by the position of your touches and now I think my opponent will manage to score... The producer there can score because I of the skill, he can, exactly, curve, but he yeah. can curve the goal, the ball, but he decided to cross... Yeah. As I can see, he's using 3-5-2 and he has a lot of... Uh, it's a nice pass, hammer was caught in there. Exactly. Yes. Hammer, so, yep. so, so good still. Yeah. He still remains the number one regular player. Agreed? Yeah, absolutely. Unfortunately, because we don't like him at all. I had a lot of strategies and, and the hammer was in every strategy, even as a CDM, now as a central back and also as a CDM. So it's on every position yeah. uh, in the game. Now I'm trying to score the equalizer through the to your hammer. Yep. And your hammer maybe to the speedster or to the pro. Okay, short pass. safe pass here, but unfortunately my, unfortunately my protector. Yeah. Give it away, but that's that, that's a good idea from you. Wow, nice catch! And if he managed to, if yeah. this ball would have gotten to the menace, it would have been a goal. The prowler here, that's yeah. I decided to try to. That's optimistic. To the, yeah, but now look at this very good interception made by my hammer, and now menace. So well, yeah, easy, easy with goal the strength, from the, yeah. with the, the shooting ability. In the beginning of the episode, I mentioned that Menace is one of the most productive uh, strikers in the game, and I can guarantee that if you pass the ball in the box to the Menace, it's impossible to miss from there with him. Would you prefer the Menace or the Prowler for shooting? Uh, the Menace. The Menace, really? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Considering my style here, so. Yeah. Uh, Again, as you can see, I'm not select selecting my defenders and I managed to do again a very good interception. Speedster, again, one versus nice one with the keeper. I think he's very the fourth time in this, in this yeah, episode. Yeah, yeah. But here, unfortunately for me, oh, I was not so able was to score again with the speedster. And the, intruder, yeah. the intruder decided to, to, to not give it away from the first touch. That's, yeah. that's unfortunate. 
I think this also has to do with the lack of response from the yeah. Yeah. But Look at the hammer in defense, yeah. he's so OP. Yeah, the my, hammer. My, my hammer is dominating the defense and also the, the, the strikers. This is going to be a tie, but I decided to keep this match because I wanted to yeah. show you how the, the hammer is uh, behaving into my defense and also let's, how you should look defend at it again. Look at, in look at every him. second. Look at him winning the duel there. Yeah. And he had, so I guess he was the MVP of this episode. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Together absolutely. with the menace with his amazing goal. But uh, you, so we didn't save the penalties because penalties are not relevant for this formation. Yeah. This was it. If you don't have super players, uh, you can still win in Infinity Arena. And maybe in the future we will do an episode trying to win Infinity Arena with uh, under-leveled players. Let's say level 8, level 7. Let's yeah, see what it happens. We can do it. I, I need some under-leveled uh, guys on Facebook. Please <laughs> add me. Okay, this was it. Yeah, Any last words? the end of the episode. Guys, if you have enjoyed this strategy, please comment down below and also tell us what strategy are you using without <laughs> the super players. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, I'm if you have enjoyed this episode, don't forget to leave a like, a comment and a share. Subscribe to our channel. Until next time, take care. Bye-bye. Yeah.